Hi, I'm Robert Tunnell, and I'm here to talk to you today about Video Watchdog, but not as a filmmaker, although as a filmmaker I love the magazine because it exposes me to other films and filmmakers, and that's inspiring. I'm not here today to talk to you about it as a fan, even though as a fan I love the magazine and the fact that I can indulge my obsessions like Hammer Films or the work of Dario Argento or Mario Bava or whatever my long obsessive list of films and filmmakers is. Um, Today I actually want to talk to you about it as a teacher, someone who teaches film, and what it means to me as an educator. The idea that film students could have access to this huge treasure trove of not only film history but film analysis, film criticism, discussion about cinema, that they could have these assets at their fingertips on their iPads, on their, on their iPhones, or, uh, that they can be exposed to this level of critical thinking and in turn have that influence their work, that's just so powerful to me. Um, if we want to see better films in the future, uh, we have to find a way to encourage students to think differently about the films that they're seeing and also to help them not forget the great cinema of the past. And I, I don't know anybody that does that better than, than Tim and, and, and Donna and the people at Video Watchdog. Um, if we're going to fight the corrosive efforts of the Real Housewives and Honey Boo Boo, well, I don't know if we have very many better weapons than the folks at Video Watchdog exposing new generations of filmmakers to Andy Milligan and Edgar G. Omer and, again, an another list of uh, filmmakers that goes on and on and on ad nauseum. Won't you please support this effort to get Video Watchdog digitized, all 176 issues, and continue supporting them so they can continue scouring the world to get the best, the brightest, and admittedly, some of the weirdest films you can imagine exposing those films to us and also analyzing them in a way that makes viewing those films a richer experience. Thank you.